seeded Michigan Wolverines against the third seeded Indiana Hoosiers. Mark McNeil just announced she would be coming back for another year of eligibility. That Ended up getting the big victory, and they are waiting to play the winner of this game. And immediately, Chloe Moore McNeil gets the feed from Yarding. Yep. That's Lauren Hansen with the first shot and the first points from. Zone is now playing the five, and sure enough, she goes inside, misses it, and Michigan is the best team in the Big Ten in terms of points allowed. Sydney Parrish at the free throw line. And here, here's Layla Filia, do everything player for the Wolverines, spinning inside. She spins, but she's seven of them coming in the third quarter alone. Argusser with the unconventional setup. Who wins the rebounding battle right now? Indiana has to keep Michigan one and gun. They're a great offensive rebounding team. If she can get up and down, that's going to be to Indiana's advantage if they can control pace of play. Indiana made their first. Ira Evans with one on the shot clock. That's Hansen from deep. A recipe for success. The question is who can put the ball in the basket? Vargas, sir, to Garzone. Finally. That's a travel on Sydney Parrish. And Kim good too. Also allowing only 63 points a game. You can Michigan work for it here, but Layla oh. the Big Ten next year. Layla Feely is one of them. More McNeil. He's in there. Main score in the history of the program. Here, zone will fire. In this game for these two. That's Lamandola, the freshman, runs into the trees. And hey, oh, with best crowds in the country. Oh, they love women's basketball and they show up all the time. There's Sarah Scalia getting on the board. One of the great Lily Meister. 52 is in the paint, guarding Cam Williams of Michigan. She was questionable headed into this matchup. Well, guys, it really doesn't matter if Mackenzie Holmes is on or off the court because she's always going to bring her leadership in her teammate. Indiana doesn't have a true five in that's healthy right now. Interesting to see if they try to feed her the ball as once again. And she comes off and squares up off the pivot. Ophelia. Man, she's fun to watch. Six points for Ophelia. Scalia is feeling it herself. Mindset defensively, she has become such a complete player over her time in Bloomington. Oh, look at this. <laughs> Scalia on the drive. Scalia has got the last eight points. Here's Cam Williams getting the feet again, going in on the sophomore Meister. That was so was her a strength to get to where she wants to go. Look at Lexi Bargasser, all by her. Jordan Hobbs in the paint, too strong. Session. Vargaser. Their zone. Each side. Michigan yet to hit a three pointer. Jordan Hobbs with the left hand. You know the guest scouting report. Good feed inside the Philia. She can't finish. Yes, she can. Vargaser. Step through, oh. score. Kyra Evans is a player Ken barnes Rico loves for her IQ and her ability to make a little plays down the stretch just like that. A great offensive player. The only thing that is not really a strength for her off. Knock them down, but that's just you, the hoop. She gets that one to go, though. Neil. Out to Parrish, top of the key three. Beautiful ball. Six to shoot for Jordan Hobbs. Another behind the back. Find some space and scores. She's More McNeil, a little bit of space, all she needs. What you've been able to do for Thank this tournament you. coverage. We applaud you, girlfriend. Just trying to be a four level scorer out here. Thank you. Athletic moment is number one on my list. That athletic moment brought to you by Mike Hall. <laughs> Vargas, sir, answer. She's one of the best coaches in the country when it comes to in-game adjustments as well. Before this game tipped off, I said, uh, I made some joke about having faith in her. She said, hey, man, you know I would have taken 20 of those to Justine, Shimmy, and Autumn for a State Farm halftime report. 
Did you emphasize autumn? Time on the men's side. Brenda Freeze in March on the women's side would be the equivalent. Death taxes, Brenda Freeze in March. Ball. A lot of free throws in this game. Four attempts for Michigan, two for Indiana. Evans for the rebound. It bounces loose to Scalia. She's hit a few of these today. What's <laughs> Whip pass inside to Parrish. Tough fadeaway shot. More concerted effort about here in the second half. Jordan Hobbs falls down. Ira and the Wolverines as they had only 21 points in that first half. The Arden Gare zone hits the three. We heard at the end of the first. Ooh. Evans around Moore McNeil and a foul on Moore McNeil. is over there looking to get whatever information. The good news is she's walking under her own power, which is always important. Scalia gets her. Well, so Brett with the ball. She was scoreless in the first half. The ball will stay here. Push and pull pace at will. Nice feed inside as Felia converts. Vargas are stuck underneath the hoop. Their zone shot, half to play her in the first half because they were up comfortably. Like to try to not have to play her at all in this game. A winning perimeter for Michigan. Hansen takes At Mizzou, she played a two guard off the ball. Was able to find ways to free. Our Big Ten team this past week. Was on Lily. Galia has not had many touches in this quarter. Felia, that's 10 on answer. Felia, 18 points. Clogging the paint, so she's trying to penetrate as much as she can, which is what you have to do to counter it. Lily Meister, quick two points. Remember to play, playing effectively. Layla, Felia off the side of the backboard. Woodson with the rebound. Oh, could you do that for me? Thanks. Thanks, pal. Oh, Williams, man. You talked about her needing to get touches. Team points two games ago, 11 yesterday. Up for that rebound. That's a foul. You've been inappropriately impressed with my math today. I'm just letting it be known. I'm happy for you. If you got to pump you up in transition defense, Indiana has not had an open look that's been easy in a while. Jordan Hobbs. Jordan Hobbs has... Didn't notice the score on that one and did the math. So thank you, though, for that. <laughs> Three to shoot for Parrish. Another turnover. And they're taking it off the dribble and getting clogged. Or McNeil can't hit the three. Garzone can't hit the two. Hobbs. That was dead. Ball game. Michigan is a team that will always consistently defend. Just like that, they hold their ground during the right. Look at that ball screen coming out, trying to trap Layla Filia. Now someone's open on the rotation. Cam Williams against their zone. Halftime, head coach saying Kenzie Holmes, their leading scorer and rebounder, was not playing, and it would depend on how the game would go. But that is a Michigan energy. Literally, the shirt says it. That's what you're going to get. Really happen. You can see her in the background standing up, potentially waiting for her turn to come in. Their zone, tough shot. Becoming a huge factor as to why Michigan is winning this, or tied now, and now up. Or McNeil with a shot clock at five, gets it to wow. go, and one. Or McNeil. Jordan Hobbs from very deep. Oh. Felia with the steal. Layla Felia, second opportunity. She has been the- Had a 17 point lead in the third quarter. That has evaporated away. And now Mackenzie Holmes comes in and she hasn't warmed up by the way. And just has to- The NCAA tournament. <laughs> Layla Felia, a foul right away on Holmes. Just where all she has to do is make layups. Battling with Cam Williams in the paint. Parrish drives right in for two. Two on the shot clock. 
Walker. Defensively, they've made all the right reads. They've kept Indiana to one and done, and they spread the floor. Oh, Lauren Hansen. Cam Williams is right there, altering that shot from Holmes. Felia, guess what? <laughs> 17 points in the second half. Hobbs. Good points. Indiana scored 15. Parrish from deep. They needed that. Who's your team that led by 17? Is now <laughs> down by 10. Two tough three pointers from Hansen. Indiana's got to go. Scalia. Good look from deep. It won't matter. Off at Iowa, at Ohio State. That's the number two, number three, and number four team in the country. Hansen again. Five. Now a turnover. Layla Felia. And one. Tree. Michigan is absolutely having their way right now. They were down 17 in the third quarter. Getting made at halftime. Clogging the paint more. Everybody was in sync defensively. Wasn't it? So many different ways to look at this run. Scalia finally puts an end to it again. You can guarantee Puerto Rico 20 wins, which she has now done every single one of.